Today I'm going to show you how to use a cutter to cut away art. And we're going to do it with the eyebrow. Inside my library right now I have two versions of our eyebrow. And we typically when you're working, you when you get a rig from the builds department, you typically don't modify any of the art that's already in the in the um, library. You want to create new art for that. So let's start by creating a brand new eyebrow. I'm going to duplicate the one that we have. In this eyebrow, what we're going to do is we're going to put create something that would, if we had an expression that we wanted to cut away some of the eye, we would be able to do that. So first, let's go take a look inside our node view. Inside our node view, we have one layer that, that has some art on the line art layer. And let's just take a look at our layers. We see we have something there. We have nothing on the overlay. We have nothing on the color art. And we have nothing on the under layer art. That tells me I can use any other layer besides the line art layer to put my cutter. I'm going to go in and take a look at what drawings are selected. And I can see that I have all of these vector opt options selected. What, is it, what do these vector options mean? Let me go to the camera. If I turn any of these off, and the, the one that I'll turn off right now is the one that shows the line art. If there's no check mark, it will not show the art on the line art layer. So in this particular case, I don't want to see what's on the overlay, color art, and underlay art. And I could just choose one. I could just choose the overlay art because that's where I'm going to put my cutter. And let's just keep the other ones on for the time being. The next video will show you how to create the art and how to set up the network for cutting away the art, cutting away the eye. Thank you for watching.